go. We need to get after him physically and get down the field. You understand me? Yeah. Come on, watch the onside. Middle wedge. One, two, three, nice! Oh, I was disappointed with the five turnovers, but it's a win and it's a sectional playoffs, so we're happy with the win. Coach said our mental preparation wasn't very good throughout the week, which obviously came up and made an effect. And just work harder next week. And uh, I don't know, I just read the quarterback's eyes, I just stay in my zone, and I just go up and get the ball. The line, as usual, just kept opening up holes, and um, I was able to get through the line and make my cut. I changed my mind. I think I like the turf a little more than the grass. <laughs> um, and yeah, my line did great for me. Well, coaches told me that last week they gave me a little break, and it was all for this week because they knew that we needed to move the ball on the ground, and they just gave me the ball out, and I did what I could do. Um, in practice, we gotta step it up. Like seniors, gotta take control and. Uh, tighten down the practices, make sure everything's working better, and can't do that next week or we won't come out with a win. Oh uh, yeah, a little bit, um, but I knew that we would suck it up towards the end and get the win. Anytime you turn the ball over five times, you have a touchdown call back, and you miss two field goals and you win, you just go home. That's all you can do. <laughs> you know, sometimes things don't go your way. Uh, but as long as you can hang in there, you know, and come out, especially today, as we said before, with so many turnovers. Just you can't do that. You just can't turn the ball over in these type of contests. And we did today. And we again, we we're just fortunate to go home and, and to be able to refocus and get ourselves mentally ready to play next week. Yeah. He had 32 carries for over 300 yards. I guess he's pretty good. Well, Andrew's a pretty good athlete, you know. And, and I thought, he, as I said earlier, when we were having conversations, he's mature not not only on the field but off the field. Today, I thought he played extremely well. Um, and again, you know, we're in those situations where we turn the ball over five times, but we still came out with a W. So I'm proud of the kids hanging in there. Yes, they're both very well coached football teams, and that's credit, you know, to their coaching staff. They're going to be well prepared, and they'll be ready to play. And, and when you play either one of them, you better be ready to go. And you can't make any mistakes. And I'll be honest, you can't turn the ball over next week, or, or one of those two teams will beat you.